Morning everyone, it's a beautiful day, I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, I'm doing well, because I'll be fucking silent! Uh, what are you saying, I hope everyone's good. Um, so I'm day four here now, fucking, I'm just loving it, I'm loving it. But this room here, so I'm going around in circles, this room here, I'm leaving on Monday to go to another place. This is £100 a week, but I'm going to another place which is £130 a month. So we're going to see how it is, you know. So about budgeting because I haven't got endless amounts of money. I've got a little bit of money here. I'm hoping to make more money so I can stay here forever. Hey, this is like a good time to say, donate, give me money, help me. Um, so I'm, yeah, I'm just going to put the work in, fight, make money and try other ways. And um, hopefully people watch all my videos and I make loads of money from YouTube. Yeah, so since my fight two weeks ago, I haven't done any training because my shins were killing me. So what I'm doing is going to go to the gym today. I said that really posh. I'm going to go. I'm going to go to the gym today. The one that's in my previous videos. And I, there was a bag there, I noticed. So I'm going to just go smash the bag up. So when I go training on Monday in a kangaroo Muay Thai, I'm not fucking useless. Gym to myself. Yes. I'm not doing any weights today, but maybe I should. There we go, upstairs. Lovely. protein powder. This vegan stuff's not cheap, but what are you gonna do? Where I went to get that protein, a driver there, I was thinking there was loads of bars and restaurants. I thought, this place looks nice, I have to come back here, but I don't really wanna come back on my own, so I'll wait till I start knowing people and then I'll go there. And then my friend Leon's coming down, he's messaging me saying, oh, I'm gonna to go to one of the places, which was right near the protein shake, to go, to go get some food and meet me there. So I was like, did I manifest that real quick that I really wanted to go there? I even shared, saved the location on my phone when I parked right next to the place that he's going to eat. So that's crazy, so that's where I'm going now. This place I wanted to come to. It's called the Shack. Yes.
Yeah, so there's loads of stuff. Look at this. All loads of goodness. Loads and loads of goodness. Oh, that looks nice. So this guy right here, he used to live right near me and we used to train together. And he found the love of Muay Thai. Went to Thailand, met a nice lady, lady boy. I'm joking. And then he moved to fucking, where did you move to? Malaysia? Malaysia. And he started working and he's been there like 10 years. 10 years? Seven. Seven years. And I bet you don't miss London. No. <laughs> I'm never coming back. Wait, like, that's what I'm gonna, that's what I keep saying, but, you know, it's all about money. And then we found this place. And it started when I came in 2012. I came to train Muay Thai for three months and I go, that's it, I'm moving. And that was it? Year, so I, it was Muay Thai? Yeah, I moved and then didn't go back. Yes, that's yes, a yes. As well. Thank you. This is a bargain as well. Right, so this costs, right? What's this? 140 baht? Two baht. Three baht? So we thought we'd come to Patong. Just, uh, just have a little drive up here. Not a little drive, long drive. But yeah. Song now we're about to go to Ali's barbecue which is right near Tiger Muay Thai we stayed before proper nice place loads of meats so we're gonna drive there now
from Patong, uh, it took us about half an hour to drive there. I actually love driving like there. It's like you just keep going, don't really stop. But I um, got to see my friend Leon, show me around. He's been there for a lot, he's, he's been here a lot, so he showed me a few places in Patong, a couple of bars, really nice. And um, yeah, it's a good time, man. So it's about 12, quarter past 12 now. I'm feeling tired, but I'm gonna get to sleep. I'm not gonna party, you know, it's sick me on my head. Um, and then tomorrow I might go down to some beaches, check them out. I might even get my beard trimmed. And obviously I'm gonna film it so you all can see. Um, so yeah, I'll see you when I see you.